Eclipse Day is over and many are curious about how much traffic actually came through the capital city and other areas in the path of totality. Channel 7's Ashley Lunningham spoke to some local businesses to see how they fared. Ashley. Yeah, but downtown Little Rock did have a lot of visitors yesterday. However, not much of that traffic made it farther into the city. Amy Counts, founder and community outreach with Nexus Coffee and Creative, says that the downtown area, because of its sites and location, did see an influx of people coming in for the eclipse. Accounts says her team did well yesterday in spite of seeing fewer locals. For many, it was their first time traveling through the natural state. Because of where we're located, being by the river and the views that we have down here, um, we hit a record day yesterday. So we had a ton of people come in and out, less locals, a lot of people just traveling through to see the eclipse or hadn't been to Little Rock. So it was their first time to actually come to Little Rock. Now coming up at six, we speak to another business that didn't have that same experience. On your side, I'm Ashley Lunningham. Right, Ashley, thanks a lot. The Little Rock Convention and Visitors Bureau says they will not have official numbers for how many people came to Little Rock until mid to late next week. They did speak with hotels in the area and they were pleased with their Sunday bookings, which is usually their lowest, slowest day.